boy, did I find a tarot spread for us today. It is called Two Truths and a Lie. There are three cards, a card for each of your truths and a card for a lie. I really was hesitant at first to pick this one because I was afraid it might make some people feel uncomfortable. But you know, if it makes anyone feel uncomfortable, that means they recognize or identify with something. So this should be an interesting spread. And I am going to start off with Enchanted Dreams Tarot. I think before I pick up my first set of cards for this reading, I need a little sip of coffee. Hmm. This would have been a fun deck to do in the middle of the night with something a wee bit stronger than coffee, perhaps. Okay, I've drawn the first set. So, how interesting. What's the first truth? The first truth is that you've lost control of something. The second truth is that this is something connected with your past. And the lie is that you had a choice. You didn't have a choice. Someone has lost control of a connection with someone from their past and they didn't have a choice. So were you dumped or ghosted or both? Okay, second set of cards here. One, two, three. Okay, first truth. Ooh, uh, the first truth is that you don't have a clue. You don't have a clue. Second truth. Um, you you don't want to accept what someone is telling you. The second truth, they're telling you the truth. You don't want to accept it. And the lie. The lie is that it's, it's a decision. This kind of isn't a decision. This is going to be something that comes up and has to be faced, like it or not. This can also imply that you are not the one in the position to make the decision. <laughs> oh, isn't this a fun spread? I just thought this would be. Okay, I got the first card, second card, third card. The first truth, the first truth is that you are not happy or you're not as happy as you would like other people to think you are. The second truth, that your unhappiness may have to do with you trying to handle more than one thing at one time, of uh, trying to juggle two of something that maybe, I know, it's just not working. Not working. That's your truth. You're not good at juggling. What is the lie? <gasps> the lie is that you can stop what you're doing. You can control things. Um, it, it's not. The lie is that it's an addiction. It's a pattern of behavior. It's karma. It's something that just goes on and on in your life. The story of your life. There you go. Well, I hope that we have some more positive cards, but let me see. One, two, three. Is anyone squirming yet? Okay. Next set of cards, the truth. Oh, the truth, you gave up the fight a long time ago. A truth, you have finished out a cycle, you have wiped your hands, you have, you have dropped something, you have let go of something, you have, it's kind of like, what I'm feeling is like the, hold on, that's kind of what I was feeling from that card. And what's the lie? Oh, the lie is that, mm, well, it looks like something is done, but, but there's just something in the shadows. If this was a third party situation with this three of wands, something's not resolved. Something has not gone away. Something has the potential to restart. There's like, there's like the potential is there. Yeah. 
this is the lie. So this is the lie. Not all done. Not all complete. This wasn't so. <laughs> it's like it's like this. It's like this. <laughs> Cross your fingers. There's your lie. How funny. Okay. Let's see, a next set. One card. <laughs> Two. I'm enjoying this too much, I think. Here's our next set. Okay. A truth. Oh, a truth is that you're very sensitive. You're emotional. You usually think with your heart. And that's how you go through life. A truth. Uh, your, your nine of wands reversed. The truth is that you are lousy at setting boundaries. Uh, you set them and then don't hold them, or you say you're going to set them, but you don't. You don't say what you mean and mean what you say, and that's the truth. You're lousy at boundaries. What is the lie? <gasps> Seven of swords. The lie is that you are not taking anything. You are not um, stealing anything away from anyone, but actually you are. And this is a general reading, lots of different people and circumstances out there. So what is it you're taking? What is it that you're stealing from someone within this scenario? Okay, let's go with another one. Let's see, one card, two cards, three cards. Here's our next set. A truth. Oh, a truth is that you have walked away from something. You chose to walk away from something. That's a truth. Another truth. Um, it took a great deal of strength and courage and resolve to finally do this. Whatever this was, it took a great deal of strength to do it. The lie. The lie is that, um, like moving, the lie is that you're going to move forward after all of this. That, oh, I'm all done. I've walked away. I've left this behind. Um, well, the, the, the lie is that, you know, there's still some energy left here. There's still choices to make. Like, you may have, think that you made a choice. You may have let people think you make a choice, but the chariot is like a card determining which direction are you going to go. It's kind of like a crossroads car. So you're not as done with something as you are leading people to believe. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is just weird. Okay. One. Uh, two. <laughs> Three. Here we go. Next set. Next set of cards. Um, a truth. Eight of wands. Things are going really slow for someone right now. Things have slowed down. A truth. A truth is that things may be going slow, but you're still hopeful. So there's still hope. And the lie. What's the lie? Oh, six of swords. The, the lie is that, no, I'm not going to get a divorce. Uh, no, I'm not going to end this relationship. This is the lie. Oops. Oops. Okay. Let's do another set. One. Two. Three. Another set of cards. A truth. Oh, seven of wands. A truth is that you're still fighting for something. No. No. The truth is you've stopped fighting for something. You have stopped fighting for something. A truth. Oh. Um, the truth is that, that you either, if you're a female listening to this, you haven't found your knight in shining armor. If you're a male listening to this, you are not the shining armor that you claim to be. Oh my God, that's a truth. Wow, that's like bad enough. I wonder what the lie is going to be. Oh, the lie. The lie is telling people it's okay. Everything's going to be fine. This is the tower card. No, it's not. It's going to be a shit show disaster. There you go. <laughs> oh, my God. If anybody thinks that these readings with this spread um, are too negative, let me know. But although you'll already be too late because this will already be posted. 
Okay, let's pick another one. A one, two, three. You know what I'm noticing is that the truths and the lie, they sometimes overlap each other in a very strange way. Sometimes the truth almost masquerades as a lie. Is anyone else picking this up? Here's our next set of cards. Oh, a truth is someone is very passionately attracted to, drawn to someone. The lots of high sexual tension and energy here. That's a truth. What's another truth? Oh, okay. Well, oh, because it's reversed. A truth is that, well, there might be a little problem with this attraction. So whatever it is, two of wands, two, 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 there, there might be some sort of an issue with this attraction. What's the lie? The lie, the lie is that this attraction, this, this uh, relationship over here, this coming together, whatever it is, this passionate attraction, it is not making you happy. It's not making you satisfied either. I think that's understandable because if you are not free to revel in this new attraction, that's just going to cause all kinds of trouble. It will also mess with your head, um, not to mention the head of your partner, big time. Um, also, um, they may not be everything that you thought they were. Once you like dig a little below the surface and you finally decide to climb out of bed for a minute or two to like have a conversation and really get to know each other, they may not be exactly what you thought they were. So there's, there's a, a, a touch of dissatisfaction here. <sighs> uh, and, and what it is is that you're telling them, oh, I'm so happy. I'm so satisfied. I have never met anyone like you. Oh my God, you are the world. You are the, you, you know, you're just the best ever thing that's ever happened to me. But mm, you're kind of scratching your head in the back wondering, yeah, is this really true? I don't know. Next set of cards. One, two, three. Oh my God. This is like a wild and woolly reading. Here's our next set. Uh, I would not want to sit down for people I know to really on a one-on-one -on -one do this reading. It's too loaded for bear. The truth is, the truth is that someone is lying. That's the truth. Someone is lying. Another truth. Um, they're hiding something and they don't want to give something up. That's another truth. What's the lie? <laughs> I'm afraid to look. Oh. The lie is that this is all um, unjust, unfair on so many levels that you don't even know where to start. The truth is that this is going to lead to serious problems on all kinds of levels. Whatever this is. There we go. Mm. I'm going to do another one. I'm not sure where I'm going to stop on this. One. Two and three. Okay. Here's our first truth. Our first truth is that you have been hurt so many times. You have been hurt. A truth is, oh, a truth is that you've trusted someone, put a great deal of faith in someone that let you down. What's the lie? What's the lie? <gasps> that you were left out in the cold, or you were ghosted, or um, you were just left to hung out and dry. That you, oh, let me think. Just let me. This card is trying to talk to me, and I have to be quiet. Listen. The lie is that there's going to be there's going to be a resolution with whatever this situation is that there there will be a satisfactory resolution because sometimes sometimes there just isn't there just isn't it is what it is okay <laughs> let's do one more and see how i feel after this one this is a rather draining um spread even though it's three cards i'm trying to pick uh Spreads that have very few cards here for these quick readings like this, so I can pull lots of different scenarios. 
uh, this is a draining one. I just think because of the energies that go with it. I'm like pooped already. So here's our next set. A truth. Uh -huh. A truth is that you are mourning and sad about something. A truth is that um, you're putting on a show of being sorry. Someone is not as sorry as they appear to be, and that's a truth. A truth. A truth is that there is, uh, oh, someone is speaking the truth, and, and it's um, either waking people up, alienating people, or it's opening a can of worms. There's another truth. What's the lie? What's the lie? Mm. The, the lie is that, that this attitude, that this way of handling things is working. This, that it's working. Oh, this is working. Whatever I'm doing over here, whatever I'm doing, it's working. This is not working. <laughs> not working. <laughs> Time to try something different. I will go. Let's go with another set. One, two, ooh, three. This one popped out. Okay. Next set. A truth. Oh. The truth is that there's been a lot of bickering about something, but I think that there's a, a couple or a group of people who are finally beginning to work things out. That's a truth. Another truth. Another truth is that there's a lots of uh, positive energy in here, and there's lots of passionate energy. Um, there's also um, a stubborn individual involved in all this, so, so this is kind of it's a big thing being able to work this all out because this is a very stubborn uh, individual and and so you're finding common ground being working things out and so those are the two truths and I'm really curious I've got to see what is the lie uh, the lie is that you're doing this for the for the good of all the benefit of all that you're doing this for a higher cause that you are um, doing this uh, like a self-sacrificing thing um, Someone is doing this to actually benefit themselves, but they want to make it look like they're being really generous and and um, forgiving and self-sacrificing, and that's the lie. That is the lie. I think I'm going to draw just one more. Oh my gosh, one, two, and three. Okay. A truth. Oh, a truth is uh, that that you're not as well off or as financially stable, or you don't have as much abundance in your life as you are, um, as you would like other people to think. That's a truth. The next truth that you feel trapped. You feel unable to get out of a relationship or out of a set of circumstances. You feel trapped. That's a truth the lie <sighs> the lie is that you're going to get a chance for a fresh beginning that you can just you can just drop all of this whatever this is going on in your life and you can just start fresh no that's a lie this has to be resolved it has to be resolved you have to come to terms with something you have to find a way to release yourself and turn this lie into a truth this has been like one of the weirdest tarot spreads that I have ever done, and uh, <laughs> as draining as it feels for me to do, I have a headache right now. Um, uh, let me know if it like affects you listening to it too. It's such a, it's such an eye-opening, kind of an emotionally, mentally confrontational spread within ourselves too. I bet a lot of us who are watching this. There's um, one or several of these scenarios that you can connect with, and it's like, shh, I don't get out of my head, get out of my head. And so it's the kind of that kind of energy. So this is where I'm going to leave it for today, and I'm going to go edit this video and get this sucker out there. So until next time, bye-bye.